Good morning. Good morning. Thank you, baby. Welcome to France. Yes, welcome to France. Just arriving in Cherbourg. Just docking up. It's a big old slow process, but I suppose it's a big old. Bucket. I'm going to go find some breakfast and then um, have a wander into Cherbourg. See what we can find. It's still dark, as you can see. The clock's went forward an hour. So it's. Uh, quarter to seven in the morning. But yeah, normally we light where we were, but it's dark here. Just waiting to dock up. Off to find some breakfast. Less spotted breakfast binders. Yeah. A little quieter this morning. Uh, what are we going? Six? Yeah. So we're gonna... A. Lovely shiny doors. <laughs> So this is first breakfast. Yeah, in the buffet. <laughs> We're really struggling to find food for vegans, aren't we? Yeah, even all the bread has milk in it. But last night they told us at dinner it didn't. Yeah, so. they told us we were safe, didn't they? So. Matt is having an incredibly nutritious first breakfast of hash browns, baked beans, tomatoes, and potatoes. And then we have some fruit. And our restaurant doesn't open until half past seven. And Matt may have expired before then. Most likely. Is it good? It's nice. Standard fare? Yeah, yeah there's no labelling. There's occasional things as vegetarian. They do have soy milk on request. But then I don't think any of the cereal is vegan. <laughs> hey ho. Welcome to France. Oh. First breakfast in France. Yes. Very nice it was too. Still very dark here. Feels weird. Because my body thinks it's what? Six o'clock? Yeah, my body's thinks it's ten past six in the morning. Yeah. It's ten past seven. It would normally be light by now at home, wouldn't it? Yeah. Yeah, have some breakfast. Go and have a second breakfast. And then mosey and shibble. Get a lovely little port old table for breakfast. Very impressed. <laughs> second breakfast. <laughs> Same as the first breakfast. Uh, other than there are mushrooms. Mm. We have mushrooms. Yep. Um, this one is hotter than the first one. And slightly worrying um, when we asked for vegan and they asked us if we wanted bacon mm. on our vegan breakfast. And then when we said, no, 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 we're vegan, we don't have any meat products, he then asked if we were gluten free. Mm. So this is a side dish. He was very amused when we ordered this. This is the only thing on the entire MSC breakfast menu that we can eat. Yeah. The only thing. <laughs> but we have a beautiful window and a beautiful little glimpse. What, what we are assuming is Sherbrooke behind all that industrialness. About, about there ish. Well, it's the car ferry port in front of us, isn't it? Yeah. Sher Sherbrooke Portsmouth. But yeah, we've got a beautiful place to eat breakfast next to a big porthole window. We'll see you in a bit. Okay, we're off the boat. We're free! Yeah. And do you know what? The weather's looking all right. The sky's blue, bit of cloud, but... It's... We've got coats on, but we're not... No. It's not raining or... So we're going to go figure out how to get into Cherbourg. Might be a bus, might walk. Don't know. Find oh, out there's in a There's a bus right there, look. Don't know. We'll find out, we'll find out in a minute. But uh, yeah, I presume we've just got to go through customs now. Um, and then, uh, yeah. Go and have a look, see what there is. Try and find some food. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> yes, he eats a lot. Well, you know. And we genuinely can't get over how big she is. Yeah, I mean, well, you just can't. You just can't get her in a shot no. at all. She is enormous. She is massive. Yeah. But yeah, we're excited to explore some France. We are, yeah. So we'll see you once we get through customs. So we're just walking down, almost into Cherbourg Centre itself. It's a bit chilly. It's good. It's all good. I mean, there's the harbour. You you can't miss her. I mean, she is really big. I don't know whether there's something to be said for too big yeah. for a small port like this. It's only a tiny little port. Although, I mean, uh, when it's time to go back, you know where to go. Yeah, you can't you can't lose your ship. So um, we, yeah. uh, we came here for the day. Um, well, we came here for lunch, actually. Yeah, in um, 2019. 19, was it, or 18? Um, 18 or 19. And this is as far as we got. One of these cafes is the other side of the bridge. We sat with some friends of ours. Oh yeah, we're going to go into Cherbourg, old city today, I think. Yes. Have a lovely explore. Just crossing the swing bridge. And then we need to leave at four, ready to get back to the ferry, but the ferry. The ferry, the little ferry that we come on. But yeah, we're going to have a lovely little explore now. Kind of heading west from Cherbourg itself, but uh, there's a ruined abbey here built by William the Conqueror's daughter, granddaughter. 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 Um, so yeah, we just thought we'd uh, pop in and have a quick look. Yeah, it's full of history, Cherbourg. Full of history. Apparently, it was um, disputed territory with the British for a while. Surprise, surprise. <laughs> um, being attached to France, I think we gave up in the end. But yeah, William the Conqueror's granddaughter had this built. Okay, so yeah, we found um, what appears to be a central square, a theatre uh, just behind the camera. A beautiful fountain. Come on, Theatre. Come all the way back, sorry if it's too fast. Fountain. And Cherbourg appears to be just waking up. It's um, about 11. Uh, yeah, 11 o'clock. Hey. It's on a Sunday morning. It's just everything's starting to open up, so I think we're going to try and find a cafe, get a coffee. Have a cup of tea, yep. yeah. Um, and then do a bit more exploring. There's a very large pedestrianised area, which is quite nice. Have a wander around, lots of shops. So, yeah, see what we can find. All right then. Okay, so 
so is that a, a walk around the Sherbourg Centre? It's quiet, but it's a Sunday, so they're allowed. Yeah. <laughs> it's weird because um, there's no churches, or um, there's one church with bells ringing, which is weird. Yeah, we expect it's but, a bit more. Um, but... Yeah. So we're now back at the harbour. Yeah, we're just crossing a. Just crossing like a bridge across the water, which yeah, it was springs out. Yeah, it was dedicated to a musician who died in 2019. So it's a fairly new bridge. Um, but yeah, so we're just going to walk across, and there's a big car for supermarket. So we're going to go and find some food. Find some food. Find some toilets. Um, have you sit down for a bit? But yeah, the weather's beautiful. It's warm. Oh, and our boat has not left without us. There no. she is. Yeah, there's our boat. Next to it is the car ferry from England. But, uh, yeah. yeah, we're just mooching along enjoying the sunshine. It turned out to be a really pleasant day in the end. Um, even, the, even the shopping mall is empty. Well, not completely empty. I, but... I can only assume that in the week it's full of people. Yeah. But the week, today, it's Sunday, it's just empty. It does make you wonder why cruise ships stop here. There's nothing open. No, nothing open at all. The centre of Carrefour is closed. This bit of Carrefour, um, the centre of Sherbourg is closed. There's nothing open. No, even in this big shopping centre, it's got the Carrefour in it. Everything is shut. All of the shops are shut. Okay, so we then hunted down um, lunch on the boat. They had a vegan option. Um, we started with a salad and then we went on to some kind of sweet potato, beans and rice. It didn't look very nice, but it did taste very good and the homemade tacos were wonderful. Um, I'm not sure what they were made of. Um, and then we went on to the standard plate of fruit for pudding um, because they don't they didn't seem to have any other options. Balcony. As you can see, it's far colder than in than this end. I don't know why, it must be the way the wind's going, I'm pretty sure. No, it's because I'm a wind. Yeah. Um, yeah. Becky thinks it's about minus 742. I'm not entirely sure it's that cold. But I don't, have a, I don't have a thermometer here, so I'm not going to argue. I would like to watch the sun go down, but it's cold. So yeah. I'm going to start with a blanket, well, I'm a quilt. Yeah. So yeah, we've left, Sher left Sherbourg and uh, yeah, we're just going to wait for the sun to go down and we've got a show at 7 o'clock. Everywhere's got cool. air conditioning's on. Either that or you're sat somewhere near a door and people keep coming in and out of them. Which is quite regular, they should just go outside and yeah. Although there are loads of people on the top deck sitting around a swimming pool yeah. in swimming costumes. It's not that warm, it's about 12 degrees. Which is, you know, pretty nippy really. Yeah, it is pretty nippy. But yeah, so again, yeah, we've, um, we're just going to sit here, drink some coffee. Right at the front of the boat is a huge theatre that seats 
I have no idea how many. I will put it on the screen. Um, and we went down to watch the show Midnight in Paris. It was very good. Um, the staff were incredibly accomplished. Okay, so then it was dinner time again, and they had a set vegan menu. We both started with just a plain salad because they weren't sure whether the dressing was vegan or not. So we literally just had uh, peppers, uh, lettuce, and bits in a bowl. And then Matt had the quinoa seed and dried fruit croquettes, which didn't look great, but he said they tasted really lovely. Uh, they came with a ginger cream and I had the vegetable curry with the basmati ripe poppadom and uh, mango chutney, which looked awful. It looked really bad on the plate, but it tasted good. And then we both had the raspberry and coconut cream cake for pudding, which Matt really enjoyed. I wasn't very keen. Um, I'm really not a pudding eater. After dinner, we, um, on our way to bed, stopped to watch the nightly um, light show. Now, this is the only area in the boat that people can congregate. So it was so noisy and it's literally full of bodies from one end to the other. They are rammed, as you can see, one on top of each other in this quite small space, really. 